Hello, Godon. Please, can you introduce yourself to the rest of the faculty? As for you, I know you are my very senior most man, <laughs> senior most counselor. Please, I'd like you to mention your full name to, for the uh, benefit of the freshmen and then postgrads who have joined us for this year. Okay, my name is Edward Gordon. I'm a final year law student of this noble faculty of ours, the only faculty of law in Ghana. We thank God. God on, please. Um, freshmen have been inducted on today's eighth roll call, and I'm sure they are anxious. And you are, you are in your final year. You've been through the system. I want to know what you what you'd like to tell them in terms of congratulations and how they can conduct themselves as law students of this noble faculty, as you rightly said. Very, very, very important. Um, the roll call has been a very important activity in the lives of the students of the Faculty of Law and as it was rightly indicated, even the Ghana School of Law has emulated from the act of the Faculty of Law in putting up this particular important activity. And my words to my dear level 100s or my freshers because we have some postgraduates also joining in level 200, I would say that they would have to stay the course. This is a lifetime decision once you join this particular faculty you would have to give your whole because the law itself just like god and the israelites is a jealous cause and you would have to make sure that you give your all to the law so i encourage them to make sure that they stay true to the course and then give their best and isha allah we are all going to make it. I can't let you go without asking you this very personal question. And our well, that's amazing. Please would like to know how you do it because it's not easy at all. How you receive these awards like subsequently, how 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 do you do it and how do you feel uh, um, upon receiving these awards? I'm sure your parents and everyone are so proud and we we for knowing you are very proud that with this is our senior, our friend and our counselor and He's, he's doing so well, we can also do well. But what can you also tell us on a personal basis? How you feel? So, my question is to do that, how you feel, and what you'd like to tell those of us coming up. Okay, thank you very much. Um, I think this is a very important question, and I must say, I'm always grateful to God that He has always been there, He has been my fortress and my shield. And it gives me the strength, the wisdom, and the knowledge to keep doing this. Because apart from academics, I do a lot of things. I do student politics. I engage in other activities of the faculty, moot court, and then what have you. But it's about determination. Once you have the love for this and you want to do it, you have to make sure that you stay the course, just as I have said earlier, and make sure that you put yourself in it. Make sure that you are already, you are always there for the law. Because the law, as I said, is a jealous cause. <laughs> it's a jealous yes. cause. Yes. So you would have to. And for my genius coming, it's about determination, hard work, persistence. You can't sleep and make it, of course. Determination, persistence, and hard work. He says you can't sleep and make it. So please, we have to precise our minds to be mining. <laughs> That's very nice. That's very nice to you. Thank you very much for your time. We are very grateful as well for your time. Yeah, so good afternoon, lovely people. We are the eighth roll call of the Faculty of Law UCC. And with me here is a very beautiful and intelligent lady whose name needs no mentioning in the Faculty of Law UCC. But for your sake, I would like her to introduce herself. Hello, guys. My name is Amacha Bakan. I am the vice president of this honorable faculty. The union for this faculty. Uh, Miss Amashia Bakan, please, which level are you? We would like to know. I'm in 400 now. All right. So please, we are here with the vice president of the Law Students Union of the Faculty of Law, UCC. And we would like to find out from her very important issues concerning the 8th rule call of the Faculty of Law, UCC. Miss Khan, today happens to be yet another rule call for the Faculty of Law, UCC. How do you feel about today's program? Oh, first of all, I just have to say that the program was a success. And then to hear that uh, the Ghana School of Law actually took after this program, is just I just felt so proud to be part of this faculty. So yeah, I'm just excited about the whole event. I can, I can see the excitement all over your face, yes, of course. And it is worth emulating that we start something and then those above us, the Ghana School of Law, 
they will learn from that. It is very, very important. Yeah. We have yet to have another in that tease, our freshers. They are now part of us as law students. What will be your words of advice to them? Um, first of all, this program is quite stressful and intensive. I mean, if you don't take it, you get intimidated. So first of all, I would like to tell them that they need to rest. Rest is very important because if you don't rest and you get sick, the amount of time you're going to spend taking care of yourself is just, it, it, it won't be to your advantage. So first we have to rest and also you shouldn't pile up your workload or the things that you need to read. After each class or before the, before the class, you read, after class you read, you prepare your notes, you brief your cases. And then I'm sure if you do that, you will be fine. It's stressful, but then it's very interesting and it's worth the while. All right. Um, you are very beautiful. Yes, of course, everything shows that you are very beautiful. There is this perception that most ladies cannot make it in the legal profession. Like, people look down on ladies and what have you. But I know you. This is the second time appearing on the summa cum laude list of the dean of our noble faculty. Please, what do you have to say to our ladies who are looking up to you? Um, first of all, being a lady, being beautiful and being intelligent is not exclusive. They can go hand in hand. So if you are a lady and then people are, you are not going to do very well in the academic field, so you have to put them wrong. And also sometimes you just do things to make yourself feel good. I mean, if you're a lady and you're intelligent, you have the confidence you can enter any room, open any door. I mean, what's, what feels better than that? So, I mean, just, just do things that will make you proud, make your family proud, your, your faculty proud, and just, just go with the, that flow. Yeah, I'm glad to also tell you that Miss Khan here happens to be my prodigal wife, but <laughs> we talk about that backstage. Um, the very last one, the very last one. Today we've heard a lot of things from our keynote speaker, um, Professor John Gachi, and I would like to know from you, what do you take from the address of our guest today? Okay, so one very important thing that stood out was the fact that he was talking about equality. And then you know that um, historically, in our societies, women, has always, the women have always been marginalized. And then to hear him talk about um, the um, steps taken in our law, the laws of Ghana to bring women as far with men, is, um, it was quite um, enlightening. And also, um, he, was, he was talking about you know, um, the opportunity that being um, open to women and um, women in Ghana. And I think that um, he was very ed uh, educated by what he told us today. Thank you very much, Ms. Shabakan, and I would like to wish you all in all your endeavors. Of course, I'm, I'm so proud of you as a prodigal wife, although <laughs> we'll talk about that later. I'm so proud of you, and thank then thank you, you very much. I thank wish you well. Thank you. And I'm have a nice day. Viewers, we are still at the eighth row call of the Faculty of Law UCC, and with me here is a very beautiful lady. So I would like to have, ask her a name and then her level. Please, what's your name and your level? Okay, please. My name is Theodora, and I'm in level 100. Okay, Theodora in level 100. Um, please, today happens to be a special day for you in the Faculty of Law. You have been inducted as a fresher or as a student of the Faculty of Law UCC. How does that mean to you? Um, I feel very excited and I am so happy because it's a, a step in the right direction because right now I'm inducted and I am now officially a law student and so I feel very excited and I know that this journey will be a wonderful one. Alright, definitely it will be. Um, how did you see today's program? What, what do you take from it? Okay, today's program was very enlightening and what actually made the whole program lovely for me was the fact that the person that it was centered around in a way was the high court judge and she was a female like me so it actually gives me hope that i too one day can also be there so yes that was fun that is lovely to know thank you very much to Dura for granting us this interview and we look forward to you as selling okay yes thank, thank you, you all right thank you hello my very own senior most honorable <laughs> i sit in class with this guy and he's he's a shy, actually i don't I, I i i i don't think i'm fit to okay. introduce him so love you please do as the honor introduce yourself <laughs> thank you thank you very much my name is Kukula Biapia. 
um, level 200 faculty of law UCC. Okay, we thank you. She didn't add that he said Shark. He oh, actually please. got an award. <laughs> Labi, how do you see the program? We were inducted last year into this noble faculty, and so this is your second role call. How did you see the program? Um, well, it was okay generally, um, and you must say that we are not in normal time, so then. It's a little bit different from the one we had last year because last year they made sure they mentioned everybody's name and everybody signed. But then this year, because of um, the times in which we find ourselves, it was it had to be short and it had to be quick. But then generally it was it was okay, very educative. The keynote speaker did say a lot of educative things, so it was good. Okay, we have our freshmen level hundred and postgrads. Who have, who have joined in level 200, please, what do you have to tell them? You have at least a year's experience from um, for in the Faculty of Law. So what would be your word of advice to these freshmen? Well, it has not been easy. That's to say, it has not been easy. Um, the law requires you to read a lot, and it requires a lot of your time. Right now, as I'm standing here, I hardly go on social media because there's no time. You have to read. There are cases piled up and things like that. <laughs> So you'd have to um, strategize your time and then you have to learn how to balance because you can't see that you're always learning books and you're always reading books and so you, you have to balance your time. So you get a time for socialization, you get a time for um, relaxing your leisure and then you get time for reading. You have to read because if you don't read, Charlie, it will over you. So yes, just read, just learn and be determined. So you, you guys should listen to him. Well, he got and he was the first on the list. <laughs> okay. Listen to him. Search, strategize your time, balance. You can't be reading all the time. So I do hope and um, wish our freshmen a wonderful stay. And uh, congratulations to uh, you all on joining us in this noble faculty. Thank you very much. Thank you. Senior too. most love you for your time. <laughs> you are very grateful. Thank you. I'm highly honored. I am so happy. I'm standing before such an honorable man i i do not think i i do not see myself fit to introduce him so please i'll do you the honor to introduce yourself because it's such a great opportunity to to have a chat with you so please we'd like to know who you are um the level the freshmen and even um the 200s who have joined as postgraduate students we'd like to know who you are and how how like how much you, you, you've seen this faculty so far. You've been here for so long. Thank you very much. Uh, my name is Kwame Duku Oben. I am the law student union president and a 400, level 400 student. Uh, first of all, I'm very grateful to, the, to God Almighty for giving us this opportunity to have this program today. Um, being here for the past three years, being this year being my third year, I would say this program, it's a form of uh, matriculation for our dear level 100 and our new postgrads, just to usher them into our faculty and to wish them the very best as uh, the semester um, continues. And we say that just as we have started on the good note, and this program has also been a success, may the good Lord see us through, or may, they, may the good Lord see them through. There are three years or four years within this faculty thank you is any personal advice apart from like any personal advice that you give to them for your your success because it's very undeniable and i'm sure the freshmen will be very much grateful to be tipped on how to hand, go about um things in the ls first of all um i would say they shouldn't forget their god that's the most important thing so they shouldn't forget their god and then they should make good use of the little time that they have because uh, often than not we have little time to read cases and then do assignments and do all these things so if we have maybe two hours a day we should make sure you use that two hours to its maximum best so that you're able to cover a lot because law it's, it's it entails a lot so don't forget your god and then use the little time that you have don't forget your God and use the little time we have. We pray our freshmen listen to all these nuggets of advice because they are coming from great people who all subsequently receive awards and, and they are, they are, they are, Anna precedes them. We thank you so much and I'm really grateful for this opportunity once again. All the best to our freshmen. Thank you. My name is Kwame Dukwabin, the president for the Faculty of Law UCC. And I have with me some be three beautiful ladies 
I'd want to ask them how the experience has been. So please you mention your name, and you say something small about the Faculty of Law, and then the experience that you've had so far. Um, I am Joyce Majambi. My experience in UCC Faculty has been one, I would say it's outstanding. Even though there are perceptions out there that the law is a difficult course or program to offer, but I've really enjoyed the law. And I pray that those out there who watch us should also take it up upon themselves. Even there will be ups and downs, but if you are focused, you can do it. I love UCC Law Faculty and I'm proud to be a law student. Thank you very much. Can you also say something small about it? Okay, I'm Nyaku Jennifer. Okay, UCC Law Faculty has been very like exciting and interesting. Despite the troubles, the ups and downs, like the like everything, everything has been good by God's grace. And then we are hoping for the best. Learning is not very easy, and even learning the law is not very it's not very easy. But with God on our side, with hard work, with determination, with perseverance, and with prayers, we know that the Lord will be very good to us. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for this opportunity. I'm Ilieza Esidazi, and I'm in level 200. And now, so far, I'll say law has been very exciting. It was very cool in level 100, and then when we started 200, we, um, it got a bit intense. But what I've realized is when you, when you are determined, when you set up your mind to, to it, and you don't forget your God, everything will be easy. And so far, things are as they were in level 100. I'm able, I've been able to settle. So I'll say that law is not as a difficult, it's a difficult program, but if you are determined, you'll be able to do it, as my colleagues have rightly said. And don't, don't shy away from reading law, those who are aspiring to. Thank you. I am Madame Bejoy. I'm Nyaku Jennifer. And I am Ilieza Esidazi. Keep watching TV and subscribe to our channel on YouTube.